Immanuel Kant once said, never mess up with the person who is carrying a huge hot frying pan. So I decided to go easy with a simple dish. Omelette. Okay, an omelette please. Our ordering Thai food is so complicated. After I tried a lot of versions of cook to order foods, I've learned how creative Thai people are able to order foods for their meals. To get only one dish could be very detailed. So I practiced very damn hard to order Thai noodles. I stayed right before the noodle cart and said confidently, Sang Lek Hang Kao. I could see the waiter shocked with my pro skill, so I went a little further. More meatballs, no vegetable, no bean sprouts, and a Coca Cola. <laughs> I can't believe his nervous system responded and functioned automatically after receiving the order. I wonder if there was any supercomputer chip implanted in his brain. His muscle movements transcended the limitations of the human body. But finally, there was a mistake. Finally found his Achilles heel. I think I should give him a lesson by ripping him off. <laughs> A free dish. I, I told you, no fucking bean sprouts. There was a Thai saying, the more the restaurant was down to earth, the more delicious the food can be. I just saw the scenery of wet street, smell, unsanitary scent in the air, all of the things that challenge the World Health Organization standard. I can tell right away this restaurant is holy grail of Tom Yong Kong. I went straight into the restaurant and I knew it. Coming to Thailand this time would be worth everything with this legendary Tom Yong Gung. I ordered loudly and confidently, hey, one Tom Yong Gung, right here. Kita <laughs> sat.